Hello learner, my name is teacher Jonathan. Welcome to Easy Elimu Learning Simplified. In grade 4, science and technology, we embark on air pollution, ways of reducing air pollution. And on our previous lesson, we looked at some of ways on how to reduce air pollution. And in pairs, can you remind us what we said, Victoria and Jen, what did we say? Some of the ways we can reduce air pollution. Yes, we said in our locality, the places where we are, we use well ventilated peat latrine, improved ventilated peat latrine. Correct. That is one way we said we should do. Another one we said we sprinkle ash in peat latrines. We sprinkle ash in peat latrines correct another point john yes we said we sprinkle water on dirty places before we sweep them those were some but to mention a few today i want us to continue more on ways on how we reduce air pollution ways on how we reduce air pollution from the points we had written yesterday i want to add more and this includes number one no smoking cigarettes no smoking cigarettes and this leads to what um, what does this say what does this say the government to ban smoking of cigarettes in common places or in public areas. The government to ban smoking of cigarettes in public places. When we ban smoking of cigarettes, remember we said cigarette can harm ourselves. It can result to lung cancer because of too much consumption of cigarettes. So the, worst, the best way to reduce air pollution is to avoid smoking because remember there are two ways of smoking you can either be an active uh, cigarette smoker or a passive and passive is you are not a smoker but the smoke that comes from the person smoking cigarettes will affect you so government to ban public cigarette smoking or if it is possible to stop it completely and these public places include schools hospitals hotels among others. Point number two, what other way can it be used to reduce air pollution? It's avoid burning tires and plastic materials. Avoid burning tires, burning tires, and plastic materials. Avoid burning tires and plastic materials. So if we avoid burning them, what should we use? We recycle them. We recycle them. Instead, recycle them. They should be recycled. Instead, recycle them. Recycle them. If they will be recycled, the better. Because we will not pollute the environment we are will have reduced air pollution another point it is to people are having vehicle or using vehicles they should use or drive vehicles with well-maintained engine why do we use vehicles with well-maintained engines this is to ensure there is complete combustion of fuels to drive vehicles people or drivers to drive vehicles with well-maintained engines engines and if you drive a vehicle with well-maintained engines it ensures there is complete combustion of fuels so there is no emission of gases which will 
pollute the air. Another point is to use farm chemicals or to reduce the usage of farm chemicals but to use environment friendly method. We reduce use of farm chemicals reduce use of farm chemicals we reduce use of farm chemicals instead use instead what are we supposed to use environment friendly methods instead to use environment friendly method and these methods include the methods which are friendly to the environment includes mechanical methods like the use of tractors to till your land instead of using chemicals cultural methods like mulching mulching biological methods like layering of car of rabbits which will eat any weed in our farms point number five on how to reduce air pollution is treating industrial wastes treating industrial wastes treating industrial wastes Treating industrial wastes to remove sulfur dioxide. To remove sulfur dioxide. Remember, we said the sulfur dioxide is the one responsible for acidic rain, which will kill the aquatic animals or corrode the roofs. And the last point, the last point is encourage the use of free pollutants encouraging the use of pollutants which are, are free source of energy pollutants free sources of energy use of pollutant free sources of energy like solar energy the use of use of pollutant free sources of energy example a good example of this source of energy is solar energy a good one is solar energy there is no use of firewood so there is no smoke coming out of this one in our groups can we read together Make sure you do not smoke cigarettes or the government to ban smoking of cigarettes and also in public places if it has to be smoked like hospitals, schools, hotels and other public areas. To avoid burning tires and plastic materials but instead recycle those plastics. After you use your plastic, you can wash it, reuse it again. After you after a tire has worn out it can be recycled either to make shoes or to make play materials for our children then we drive vehicles with well maintained agents why do we drive them to ensure there is entire or complete combustion of fuels then we reduce the use of farm chemicals why do we reduce the use of farm chemicals to make sure there is no air pollution but instead to use environment friendly methods like use of me mechanics or mechanical farming use of tractors rearing animals which can eat the weeds treating the industrial waste to remove the sulfur dioxide which is responsible for acidic rain and the last one is the use of pollutant free sources of energy like solar energy an activity for us kindly go and take photos of ways of reducing air pollution and 
stick them to our portfolio for our future reference. Have a wonderful time. Bye-bye.